Welcome to the recap of the Cubs 10-6 victory over the Milwaukee Brewers Saturday night at American Family Field in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. I'm David Kaplan. It's brought to you by your Chicagoland Chevy dealers. Find them at ChevyDriveChicago.com. So I watched a game tonight here at the 51st annual Lou Malnati's Cancer Benefit for the Malnati Brain Tumor Institute at Northwestern. There are over 550 people here. They raised over half a million dollars. I am see this and I'm watching the game and people are crowded around my phone, literally crowded around my phone. What happened to the Cubs? Oh, we got to watch this. And so before all the festivities got started, we were watching the game and we were talking about the Cubs and people are so disappointed that there's not going to be playoff baseball. Cubs won tonight. The Marlins won 7-3 over the Pirates. So it's over. It is over. They have been eliminated. It is what it is. Was it a fun season? You're damn right. As my friend Ross here said, uh, if you had told me and all my buddies who are on a Cubs text chain in June when the team was scuffling that September was going to matter, I would never have believed it. But now that it mattered and we fell short, we're all pissed. And I understand that philosophy. I feel the same way again. Folks, were they going to win the World Series? Probably not. They were not good enough. They didn't have enough depth. My problem with the whole thing was, if you're going to try by going to get Candelario and Jose Quas, and I know they didn't give up a ton to get those guys, you owe it to the guys in the room, and more importantly, you, the fan, to go add on bullpen help and try and win. Or otherwise, take the PR hit and just stand up there and say, I didn't think we were ready, and I traded Cody Bellinger or whoever it is away to get more prospects. You can't do both. If you're going to try, you got to try. And that's what bothered me about how this whole thing went down. I love Jed Hoyer. I think he's outstanding at his job. I really, really do. He was right on letting Baez go. Bryant. Rizzo didn't get as much money as the Cubs offered him. Same with Wilson Contreras. All these moves that he decided to make, he was right on every single one of them. He took a flyer on Cody Bellinger, a one-year pillow contract. He was right. He got Seiya Suzuki when a lot of teams wanted him. He was right again. I just think they owed it to the fan base as a franchise to try and get to the playoffs once they decided not to sell. There's my perspective. Our Feldco play of the game. Jan Gomes, grand slam in the first. Cubs had a 6-0 lead. Jordan Wicks was terrible tonight. It happens. He's done for the year, obviously. They tied it at six. Cubs win it. Hit three homers in the game. Morrell, Wisdom, and the Gomes Grand Slam. Cubs lose uh, their opportunity to get to the playoffs, but they win tonight 10-6. Have a great rest of your night. Bears recap coming up tomorrow. Appreciate you all season long. I love all of you. Take that.